There is an urgent need to invest in the future of agriculture. Value chain players play a critical role in incentivizing this transition. Regenerative agriculture is absolutely critical in transforming the food system. Farmers are not the problem, they are the solution. Regenerative agriculture is a powerful tool for reversing biodiversity losses and building more resilient value chains in making it central to our biodiversity strategy. The shift to regenerative agriculture is crucial for the future of the entire industry that depends on plant-based raw materials. At the end of the day, what matters is the farmer. Is the farmer being able to go on this transition from conventional to regenerative? And so our solutions need to be farmer-centric. We all know that through the climate change, we have more extreme weather events and um, the farms need to be resilient against these. Regenerative agriculture has proven to help farms to adapt, so to be more resilient against these heavy rains and drought. The soil is just more resistant. The yields are more stable. Five years ago, One Planet Business for Biodiversity was created as an action-oriented cross-sectoral coalition with the ambition to transform agricultural models to protect and restore nature and improve farming livelihoods. The adventure in which we embarked with OP2B five years ago is a transformational journey. I think that uh, OP2B uh, achieved a number of very important success. First one is obviously putting regenerative agriculture at the center of the conversation. OP2B is really the platform to advance regenerative agriculture at scale. We think regenerative agriculture is probably the most critical initiative for the food industry because it secures food in the future. Whether we are individuals, farmers, scientists, or businesses like ours, we can and need to be nature stewards, taking responsibility for nature through both individual and collective actions. The transition to regenerative agriculture is the future. That's as simple as it is. It's difficult to achieve, but we will achieve it because there's no other way. I, I'm convinced, and it, it actually has to scale up. So moving from a few pilots in different parts of the world to the standard method of doing agriculture. So uh, that's what we have to drive as an industry, together with the farmers. It's our collective responsibility to de-risk the shift from conventional to agroecological practices. By developing financial incentives and a holistic support mechanism, we are making progress. To date, OP2B members have invested 3.6 billion in the transition, engaging approximately 300,000 farmers across their supply chains. I want to thank the leadership of the OP2B team for bringing a lot of willing companies to work together in a very organized way, in a very productive way, coming up with very, very fundamental uh, steps forward in defining what is regenerative agriculture and how can we work together again with the farmers. So the name of the game for our OP2B are moving forward is to broaden the coalition to make sure that we put farmers at uh, the center of everything we do, and to impact. We call upon all stakeholders to unite their efforts. Let's collectively scale up and transform our agricultural systems to be more resilient and sustainable for the future of all.